Locust bean surprise. Ooh, sounds tasty. I cannot believe you're allowing Wayne to waste our college fund on mail order junk food. I'm a gourmet. Get used to it. Poison. Well, no wonder, Wayne. It says Organico here. Lucian should have this one. Lovely. For you, it's organico. Boys, stop hooting! I, I can't help it, Mom. It won't stop. Out of here! Now, young man! I heard noises over here last night. It sounded like a, a swamp phantom. Swamp phantom? <laughs> Sometimes you are so unscientific, Tony. Oh, yeah? Well, how do you explain that hideous smell? There are any number of perfectly natural explanations. Yeah, swamp phantoms. Fizzing Chinese dragon flakes. This one comes with a warning. What does the warning say? Do I look Chinese? <laughs> this isn't people cereal. That Lucian Cramp must think we're farm animals or something. I heard that sound again. It's a swamp phantom for sure. That's your danger call, son. You need to save it for real emergencies. Oh, I remember this stuff. Atomic stardust. I thought it got banned. Not in Malaysia. And look, a free gift. One million exploding space monsters, alien pets that grow in a bowl. Cool. Space poppers? They still have them! Oh, double cool! Something's been bothering these geese, and I heard more noises, too. How's that for evidence of swamp phantoms? These geese are just tired, Tony. And you heard a noise, not a phantom. You're just super superstitious. <laughs> I am not. You just don't respect my beliefs. In fact, you don't understand me at all. You even gave me secondhand farm food for breakfast. You're banned. Hey! Get out of my swamp. Just add water to space monsters and keep warm. Easy. Come on, come on. Come on! Oh, you have to wait for him to grow. And then they explode, right? And how? Oh, and don't forget to feed him. Oh. 
Keep out! What's the dog bath for? Very funny. This is a scientific swamparium. I am going to attract wildlife of my own. Best of luck. It'll be dark soon, and you better get home and hide from the swamp phantom. Where's my cereal? More bean food? I hate cruddy doubles. Pond Paradise does mail order equipment. He's not the only one who can squander his inheritance. Eat up, little space monsters, and grow big! <sighs> Still no wildlife. What am I doing wrong? You like nature? What's wrong with these? They dead! Hmm. These require further study. Leave them with me. Welcome to your new home. They're fine now. They're probably just hungry anyhow. See, they ate all their food. I got visitors, Tony. Lots of them. What? <gasps> now, uh Tony. If I'm banned from your swamp, you're banned from mine. Besides, this is science. You wouldn't understand. Chilean Mountain Crisp. Mm, strawberries. Chili! Cereals here. Double doubles. So I can use this. I know what you guys like to eat. Bean food. What is this thing? A dog bath? It's some kind of scientific phantom farm. Uh, uh, uh. You came out! <clears throat> nice alien! I'm your friend! the drain where they belong. Sugar Mop, we men have formed a posse to go hunt the creatures. Shh, they're on to us. My Tony's a little on the scared side. Can he stay a spell? You in here, Tony? Uh, just checking for dust. <laughs> I'll go now. You don't have to go, Tony. I'm sorry about the whole swamp monster thing. I was stupid. You know, there's a whole world of bizarre phenomena that science simply cannot explain. Has the angry mob gone yet? You realize it's me they're after. I am the mothership! 
Don't listen to him, Tony. He's just been overeating cereal. Oh, yeah? Want me to prove it? Horace! Bogey at 10 o'clock! Oh, hey, uh, 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 Don. Uh, uh, 9.30. <laughs> Coming your way! Butterball! Mom's gonna be away for a spell. Uh, it's okay with me. <gasps> cool! Uh, ah! uh! Hey, where are all my nature nibbles? I don't know. Maybe a squirrel ate them. Fighting with the cowboy, gold. No, <laughs> oh, I can't find one thing on my list. I didn't make the paper, but you did, Dad. <gasps> Dad, let's see. Hey, come on, give me the paper. Come on, come on. boys. It is obvious to any mother that you boys can't be left on your own for one minute, let alone one week. I'll start interviewing for a temporary mother first thing in the morning. The little boy heard a noise. He looked under the bed and saw... <laughs> I'm going to be your new mommy. 24-7 care? It's perfect! No, oh, dear! Uh, no! I, uh, I mean, uh, but, uh, uh, what about the mommy test? <laughs> it, we have to be fair. Miss Hissy's a qualified teacher, for sud's sake. door certainly is stiff. <laughs> so, what's for breakfast, young man? Sugar. How about these? I don't know how to make waffles. The package couldn't be clearer. A small boy offering his mother one, two, three, six waffles. So, I can't make them. I can make cereal, though. Good morning, dearest. <laughs> no, uh, keep away. <laughs> Late for work. Don't touch me! Bye! <laughs> Today we're going to learn all about parasites. 
Lucian's mother told me that he became personally acquainted with parasites last year. Now, this special medicine is all that stood between this class and a plague of bottom worms. <laughs> worm butt, worm butt! Yes, Wayne, it is funny. But not as funny as your mystery diaper rash. I don't eat sugar tarts. They're revolting. Too bad. Your father's taking me to an oyster restaurant. <laughs> Just like they do in the movies. <laughs> and this place is a mess, boys. Clean it up while we're out. Your mess. Get bent. Hey! No work, no food. Your decision. Dad! <laughs> I always wanted to have a family. And now I know why. Family life is a breeze. Oh, you smell smelly. Ooh, it's nice. <laughs> Need shower. <laughs> she's gone, and she's taking Dad with her. She's stolen her last sugar tart. It's time for revenge. Uh, I'm not sure this is a good idea, Wayne. This is spying. She told the whole world you had worms, didn't she? Yes. So now we find dirt on her. Keep a lookout. I'm going in. This sure looks suspicious. Aha! Girl fans, come see! Since you boys like dress up so much, let's see if we can't find something more suitable for you to wear. Permanently! They're from last year's school play, The Prince and the Pauper, so I guess that makes you a royal butler. And you, a beggar boy. Either way, servants live outside. You'll both be much happier in the shed. Look, Mommy, a beggar boy. I have to be the beggar boy. I'll switch with you. I don't mind. I have no mommy, and I live in an old shack. I have to do work and get nothing to eat. My new mommy is mean, and my daddy smells bad. Wow, pure gold. Okay, now look sad, please. Sad. You stink. Really stink. Uh, yes, sir, I, I, I know. You see, I, I can't shower at home, sir. <laughs> we have a temporary mommy and... No excuses, crap! This is a soap factory. You come to work smelling clean or don't come in at all. I don't have to stay in this dump. I've got a hat full of cash. I'm going someplace nice. Let me in! I'm an orphan now! I got money! Why didn't you say so? Have a chimney? Sure! For Christmas! It's vital that a cowboy knows exactly how many tassels are on his uh, uh, jacket. And this is what cow ladies do? All the time. It's considered romantic. <laughs> One, two, <laughs> three. Twelve. One, two. Ah. Lily, 
Monday. It was only a game. This doesn't sound like a game to me. Read. Holiday mom in stinky husband, kitty slave, slum house shock. My mother. I'm upstairs, boys. What's she still doing here? Miss Hissy's got housework to catch up on. Toot sweet. Yeah, oh, uh, she's missed a bit. <laughs> Honey apron. <laughs> Thank you, dearest. 